From the outside, your home might look like it's in great condition, but there's a harmful gas that could be hiding inside. Today we're testing a home for, for radon. Radon is a colorless, odorless gas that comes from the dec decay of uranium and other uh, geological products in the, in the soil. And it That's David Boberg with Environmental Health, and he says radon can be dangerous. It comes up into your basement um, and can accumulate in the interior uh, portion of the home and can have chronic effects on your health and cause lung cancer. To prevent that, Eric Gabrielson with Landmark Environmental came out for a professional radon test on this Bloomington home. When we build a house, we create an unnatural situation for the radon to accumulate there. People should be testing at least every two years when they do structural changes to their house or when, when the neighbor says, I had a really high hit, maybe you should test too. While do-it-yourself tests can be done to determine if there is a radon problem, Gabrielson says his setup garners better results. This is uh, slightly more sophisticated than what the actual, than a regular homeowner would typically use. These are charcoal type uh, test kits that can be uh, acquired through the state or you can even uh, acquire them through a private lab if you like. Um, these aren't quite as accurate. This is a continuous passive um, analyzer, and after, after 48 hours, we'll be able to download it and have uh, an instant average of what the testing was like over the weekend. It's, it's more accurate. It's more accurate at low levels. Um, the test was set up on a Friday. By Monday, preliminary results were in. It looks like it's running between 2.8 and 2.7. Good news, the level should be below four picocuries per liter. Once Gabrielson prints these numbers, he downloads them to a computer where a graph will give clear results. It's also recommended to test during the winter time because radon levels may be higher. A thermal rise from, from low to high and that makes a stack effect which actually can pull in radon and so radon levels are always going to be at the highest during the heating season. If you want to forego hiring a professional, swing by City Hall where there are a limited number of at-home kits. Coupons are also available for short and long-term kits at reduced rates. For more information on Radon, head to the city's website and search Radon.